Hello everyone, and welcome back to Cheeky Chooks, which really should be renamed the Palace of Golden Eggs, because we are so rich! Look at this! We are up to $53 million, and I haven't even cleared out the hen houses yet. Oh my gosh! I think that we are so close to being able to finish everything that Cheeky Chooks has to offer at the moment. We just have a few more buildings we need to upgrade. We need to have 20 gold chooks, and we need to have 100 chooks overall so that we can get that lovely chess table. And uh, today is going to be the day where hopefully we will be able to get a lot of more golden chooks. Get out of here, you little ghosty. A lot more of the golden chooks. Get out of here, ghosty. You're startling my chooks but a lot more golden chooks but we're gonna need to make a much larger farm in order to do that because when i tried to buy another gold egg i was told you don't have enough food you gotta feed your chooks lady so that's gonna be our goal for the day is building up a farm and hopefully it will become daylight soon because i like to hatch the chooks when it is daytime because i can't see any of them right now so we'll see what happens but let's come over here and sell the eggs oh my gosh we have so much money we have 50 million dollars. Oh my goodness. We can build whatever the heck we want right now. This is going to be fantastic. And are you doing okay over there, Miss Chook? I'm sure she's fine. She's having a grand old time flapping about the pumpkins. That is just so cute. But let's do this. So we are going to try to have a ton of food and we're just going to decorate and expand this farm to our heart's content. So let's see what happens to be in the land features. We have got the pumpkin patches. We've also got the flower patches, which give happiness but no food. And meanwhile, the blueberry bushes and the redberry bushes give food and happiness. So we'll probably look into that. And I was thinking it'd be kind of cool to come in and use the feeders. Like, maybe see if we could work with the large feeders to sort of... Not the large ones, unfortunately. To sort of make them look a little bit like a, a field of some kind. And I don't think you can actually do that with the large ones. Uh, the medium, or like the small feeders... We could almost get away with doing that, especially if we mixed the small feeders with like flower beds. Like you could almost make it look like that. So we might we might do that with the flower beds. Are there water features? Maybe a water pump? I could see a water pump working for our, our Grand Pecan's little house that she has. Oh, we might want to upgrade her place because it will improve the quality for our jukes. Oh, and let's give her a pond. Like every creepy witch needs a mysterious pond behind her house, right? Uh, so we'll give her a pond. We haven't unlocked the fountain yet. Actually, what does it take to unlock that fountain? Because that's a really cool looking fountain. 20 gold chooks! Well, thank goodness. Get out of here, ghosty. Thank goodness it is now time to hatch open some of our golden chooks because the sun has come up. So let's do this, guys. We're going to come right down here and see who is going to be joining our wonderful hen paradise today. I'm really hoping it'll be more of those uh, wooden chooks with the little leaves on top. Oh, look at everybody. Everybody's come to see the newbies. No, it looks like the grandpa Caw has been working with her has been working with her zombie chooks too much. Well, we have just added in another new chook named Carly. So welcome Carly to our wonderful farm. <gasps> Felicity! What? I am so glad we have an arcade for Felicity to play at cuz she looks amazing. Oh my goodness. Felicity they're so cool. I love the golden chooks. I can't wait to see how many we have. Uh, and we've got plenty of room to hatch open more chooks too. So let's actually come in and I guess I need to get more food stat, even though I want to try to make it like super fancy. We are going to make the farm, but I guess we should have maybe like another, this is kind of where they do the chicken dance. Let's have like a little cafe back here. That would make sense to like build a cute little cafe that we can say they eat at. So let's grab the large feeders and maybe like put a drinker at the back. So a couple large feeders, like so. There we go. And then like a large drinker back here. And we can pretend this is like a little, you know, like a little cafe, like a little soda, uh, soda fountain, like a little buffet spot they can come over to. I wonder if there's something I can put back here. It'd almost be cute to add in a, like, coop 
and be like, yeah, this is this is like the the spot where people can come in and, and get some, or like the chooks could come in and get stuff. But I, the coops, I think, would be frustrating if they weren't high quality in the end. Um, what else could I put back there? Chess table is still locked. The jumping castle is still locked. We have given our chooks so much and we can give them so much more. Uh, maybe some hay bales? Yeah, because I kind of want it to look a little bit like the counters for some sort of cafe and maybe like a little, can I stick that in there? Maybe if I work with it. I want it to sort of look like the counters for a cafe, like one of the chooks runs a chook cafe. <laughs> And so you come over and they'll they'll like order up like get you get you a nice soda They'll get you an order of like the cabbages. There we go I don't know why but that just is tickling me because it's like a little a little arcade And those are the things that arcades have in my opinion We also might make like a special little chook bath place because that would be kind of cool to you um, fun park sand pit tires might be kind of cool to see some tires somewhere. Logs, trees, let's just stick a tree back here, just cause I can. All right, so there's that. And then let's upgrade these large feeders with everything we've got so that we've got enough food. We've got enough water. There we go. Let's get some more happiness with these hanging cabbages. Oh, maybe I should actually, oh, now I want to move the hay bale and just have like a row of hanging cabbages. That would be really cool. Instead of like having the countertop things, it would look like, that would be really cool. Let's do that. Let's actually scooch this over and have the cabbage kind of like there. Okay, do that. Come get this one. We'll scooch this hay bale just at random. Just have some like organically placed hay bales might be fun. Uh, let's clear that out. And where am I, where am I, uh, let's see, fun stuff, hanging cabbage. Can I have, yeah, we'll have a little row of hanging cabbages and now it really does look like a little buffet. So you can come and get your hanging cabbage and all of your food. <laughs> then you can come over and go play video games all day. Who wouldn't love that life, right? There we go, hopefully we have enough food. All right, oh, have 250 spare resources. Boom! I think that implies that we have enough food, my friends. Oh, look at all of them do the chicken dance. Holy moly, they're doing a big chicken dance. Oh my gosh, there's so many Zubats. Get out of here. Get out of here, Zubats. All right, there we go. All right, now I think we can actually afford some golden eggs without even having to worry about it. Nice, all right. So these guys will hatch up two whole minutes. Do they need like more time as time goes on? Let's get all of these to 150 for the incubators. I wonder if it's incubator one in the future updates, if there's gonna be like incubator two, cause that would be kind of cool. Or like imagine like a row of incubators, a stacked, uh, like a stacked little setup of incubators. So you could put like one, two, three eggs all together. Oh, they're having some sort of meeting. It's mostly a lot of the darker chooks, so some of the uh, zombie chooks, and Count Chucular, Cluckular. So I'm a little concerned, to be honest, about what could be happening there. We'll worry about that later. But all right, so that is done. Now we still need to wait for these eggs to hatch, unfortunately. Uh, I'm kind of thinking we might get another set of incubators, maybe start hatching other chooks in other spots. We'll have to see. Um, let's come over here and I want to continue to- are you stuck? I think this chook is stuck. There you go, sweetie. Are you still stuck? Dorothy? <laughs> Dorothy! <Are> you... <laughs> now I want to make some sort of terrible joke about like, Dorothy, are you- do you need your red slippers? There we go. We'll have to see if we can help poor Dorothy out in a little bit. Get out of here, Zubat. Cause she seems stuck, poor thing. Uh, all right, but back to land features. I do want to make, let's do red berry bush. I wanted to make a little a little farm today, so let's do it. And let's do flower beds to separate our little farm. And then I think I'm gonna do a alternating mix. Let's do it like this. We'll do red berry bush and then three, I think three is probably best. So red berry bush, red berry bush, red berry bush. And then we'll do, yeah, I wanna do them in monocrops, which means all the same crop. So we would do this one. Look at my cute little farm. 
Look at it. It's amazing. It's so cute. Oh, yeah. This is everything I dreamed of when I dreamed of Hen Paradise. All right, and then let's come down here. Put this one there. Get I hear you bad. You can't have you can't have the red berries. I'm sorry. This is this is Hen Pyre for Hen Paradise. Oh yes, it's time to hatch the golden chooks. Yes, Alexandra. That is such an appropriate name to have on a pharaoh chook. So we've got one of those ones. Beautiful golden pharaoh chooks. <gasps> Caroline. I thought our wooden chook was good. But now I see, I didn't even know what the golden chooks could be. And then Tony, who is another one for our wonderful witchy chook. Um, who was she again? Oh dear, somebody is really having some issues over there. But the Grand Pakal has more vampire chooks. There she is, right over here. I see you, Grand Pakal, on your little broom. You're adorable, I love you. But she has more zombies to add to her powers. And they're still having their little meeting over here. That's so cool. All right. Can I get more golden eggs? I can. Look at that. I think that it takes longer and longer for them to hatch, maybe? Each time? Because I've spent a lot of money trying to upgrade th those incubators. And it doesn't seem to be having much of an impact. Uh, let's see. How close are we? We are so close to unlocking that fountain. You know what? Let's get a couple more incubators just because we can. I've been kind of limiting us on incubators just to sort of do some experiments. Oh, the ghost scared. Did you see how the ghost scared so many of my poor jukes? And we'll kind of call like this little park we have, like maybe the nesting park where our jukes can actually nest. Look at Caroline. I love her. I had no idea we could have a peacock juke. Like, that's just amazing. And what would it take? One hour? Holy cow! Let's go with some rare eggs just to even it out. But now I remember what- Get out of here, ghosties! Now- Get- Now I remember why I upgraded the incubator so much. Uh, we'll go ahead and upgrade this one, too, to level 100. And then eventually we'll catch it up with the other incubators. I mean, oh no, look how much money we've spent. I can't believe it. We're down to just 40 million. What are we going to do, my friends? Just how will we possibly endure? All right, let's go ahead and get this one up. I think I have all of the rare chooks that I kind of want uh, in order to reach that like goal of getting to the 100 chooks for the chest table. It'd be kind of cool if we could have a just, oh, oh, I wasn't even paying attention. Diana, welcome, a wonderful green chook. It'd be kind of cool to have nothing but like green chooks. Like imagine if you just keep going again and again and again. Like Vanessa, you can rehome and remove some of the chooks. <laughs> That'd be cool if I could make a second save file and the challenge was to only be able to win with nothing but like green chooks and, and cookie chooks. That would be kind of cool. All right, well, let's hatch this last little batch of eggs. I didn't quite make as much progress on my farm as I wanted, but that's okay. We can do more work on the farm next time too. Uh, and I'm gonna have to upgrade all of these things eventually, but I like the idea behind it, like what I've got going on over here. And hopefully it'll mean that passively, without really paying attention, I will have upgraded so much stuff that I won't ever really have to worry about food again, no matter how many golden chooks we have. Yes, I could do it the simple way and just buy a feeder, but come on, this is fresh organic blueberries grown on our very own land. I'm sure that has some value for our wonderful chooks. That's important. Uh, all right, let's just put down one more, just one more. Oh, yep, our golden eggs are ready, so this will be the last one for now. And let's go ahead and hatch them. So get out of here, ghost. You are not allowed just to stare creepily at my eggs, okay? All right, will we get another beautiful peacock chook like Caroline? <gasps> we did! Allison, welcome! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. I am so happy. Allison, you are glorious. Oh my goodness. Welcome, welcome. Oh my gosh, we're so lucky. I am so happy right now. We have got so many lovely peacock ladies. And of course, Donna, the, the zombie that scares the, the Badoo dads out of all of my chooks. So there's that, my friends. How close are we? How close are we? We need only two more golden chooks and we will have finally managed. There's one, 
there's two, there's three, why not keep going, there's four, there's five. <laughs> And when we come back next time, we will be able to finish off some of our challenges by having 20 gold chooks, and we will start working our way over towards the grand, grand goals of reaching 100 chooks and putting down those wonderful chook chess tables. At which point, I'm sure the logic skills of our chooks will go through the roof, and next thing you know, we will all be living under their rule. That's been the plan all along. The chicken, the egg, and the egg pyre, I think. But all right. Enough silliness, if you guys could do, please toss a lovely flower to my wonderful chooks by leaving a like. Consider joining and subscribing because you can become one of our many, many chooks, including the glorious peacock chooks that we have just added. And let me know how your cheeky chook empire is going, empire I should say, because so many of you have started doing this as well and I'm so excited. The devs are so kind and friendly. I can't wait to see what future updates happen to like show up. And I, I thought this was just going to be like a quick experience, but no, no, I absolutely love these chooks. I love them oh so much. And I will share more of their little chookapades with you guys next time. So I'll see you guys then. Bye bye.